this alone Even though I am strong Need something more than me Someone to push me to me free Let's see what we can do Together me and you Can't be afraid to try Kiss your fears goodbye No looking back You and I were on the attack Falls me ahead Running down the sand Ooh, Such a different feeling Both of us be leaving We can make it better Together we Hurry up, sis. I'm coming, I'm coming. You know how I am with these steep hills. <sighs> we did it. We made it to the top. Now we can see all of Foxy Harbor from up here. Isn't this beautiful? It feels like we're on top of the world. At least where I want to be. You know, once we get through high school and all, I want to become a famous actress. And hopefully Beth gets a better life than this. Yeah, unless you die from a rusty nail or something. <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> Anyways, we should probably head back to the hotel room. Yeah. <laughs> oh, good morning there, Toyo. Is your arm feeling better now? Yeah, but first I need a test on something. <laughs> oh. <sighs> hmm. Good as new. Idiot, you almost ruined my cheese and crackers. Still, I don't care. Those two are gonna be the death of me. How can I ever expect to... <sighs> How am I ever to turn those two into forces of good? Forces that benefit society. Hmm. Maybe Lil Bed could teach some sense to them. Yeah, got it. Uh... What happened? Where am I? Why am I upside down? Oh, don't worry, Cortex. We're somewhere where your little buddies can't find you. Why did you bring me here? Don't worry, Cortex. We just want to ask you a couple questions. We're interrogating you as it seems. Yeah, you said... We've heard that you were constructing gears made of bench stone for the League of Tiblal. And we just want to know what you know about them. And about what the Dark Alliance is planning. That's none of your business. Oh, wait. Oh, you know, actually, can you just wait for me to, like, spin the other face in your direction? Uh, there you go. Alright, so I'm meaning to ask you. Oh, no, I'm I'm spinning again. Like, this is a me who's doing it. It's, it just goes on its own. <sighs> Got it. Ow! Alright, quit playing games, Cortex. What is the Dark Alliance planning? Hmm, like I'll ever tell. Because I am not a snitch. <sighs> you know, I doubt he's going to talk. And how about we make him? Steph, hand me the crowbar. No, we're not torturing our prisoner. Why not? Do you know the things that he's done? Yes, and still, he's a human being who has the right to proper and humane treatment. Look, we gave him a chance, and if he's not gonna talk, then we'll just have to pry the answer out of him. No, we're not doing anything that involves physical harm whatsoever. 
Yeah, yeah, no physical harm. Blah, blah, blah. You sound a lot like Bruce, Jason. I am nothing like Bruce. I do things differently here. Well, here is different. Guys, we're all on the same side here. We just need to find a way to get the answer out of Cortex. Oh, and I think I know how. Call in the Sia. Wait a minute. We have a Sia? I didn't know we really had a Sia. <laughs> Uh, uh, uh. What is it that you guys want? Can't you see I'm trying to make another mukbang video? Well, you see, we need to get the answer out of Cortex here, and he's not speaking. He refuses to, like, tell us what the Dark Alliance is planning, so we want you to get the answer out of him. Alright. I think I might know how to get the answer out of him. <coughs> Number 15. Burger King Foot Lettuce. The last thing you want are your burger cake. Girl, it's someone's foot fungus, but as it turns out, it might be what you get. A 4 channer uploaded a photo, anonymous. Look, fine, 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 I'll, t I'll tell you everything. This game, please, not have him speak another word. It's already too much. Oh, that was easy. How did you- I have my ways. Do not question the interrogating master. Look, my pals in the Dark Alliance want me to make the gears for the League of Temple All, as these gears have the ability to overturn the tide of the war in the Dark Alliance's favor. I was gonna plan on using them to betray the Dark Alliance after they used them to wipe you guys out, but since here I am, I'm offering to help you. I'm the one who made these gears, and I know how to just deactivate them. But they aren't the only gears that I've made. We are currently constructing a giant mech the size of a skyscraper that has the power of hyper small bit. That is the real danger you should be worrying about. But that won't even matter, cause you, we all will be dead by then. So let me help you, and maybe you can do something for me in return? Hmm... You know what, Dr. Cortex? We might consider. But for now, see ya. Start talking about Burger King foot lettuce and whatnot. Alright. Burger King foot lettuce. No, no, please. Please don't talk. Don't speak. No, no. Oh. What's his problem? I don't know. Yeah. Yeah, 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 huh? Yeah, 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 yeah. You're gonna have to try harder than that if you can match the speed of Ultra Instinct. All right, this must be the place where she is. And look, there she is. Yeah, 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 yeah. A little bit. Wait, what? Da. Uh, uh, are you okay? A uh, little bit. What are you doing here? I just came to visit. A oh, little bit. I see that you've arrived. Yes, indeed, Master Carne. It's, it's nice to meet you. See you again. Uh, it's been quite a while since we've seen each other, you know. <laughs> a little bit. This is nice to see you again. Especially after everything that's happening on your Earth. Yes, indeed. How's it going here and, um, Earth 8's final destination? You know, it's... it's something, you know. Not that boring and... also not that interesting. What she's trying to say is that she kind of misses home. Yeah, I guess you could say that. So, this is where the so-called gods of this universe live. If everyone else struggling to survive, that people benefit from it. Hey, you two realize that you shouldn't be rude to any of these guys. They could basically turn you to scrap metal if they can. And also a little bit. Can you come with me for a second? Yes, I will. Just stay put and uh, don't do anything. Yes, a little bit. Uh, what is it that you need? Yes, um, um, I got a question for you. Uh, what are those two doing here? What do you mean, what are they doing here? No, why did you bring them here? You see, I just didn't want to, to leave them alone at the Samurai X cave. Yes, but why here? Why did he even take them into the Samurai X cave in the first place? Look, I see the potential in those two. 
those two can do good things, I know it. And I bet that in a matter of time, they'll become forces of good. Just listen to me, Lil Bet. You helped me realize that these people, that those two, could change. So I just want you to listen to me. I know that they are just like us. So just listen. I need your help to help them become better people. So please help me. This is one of the reasons why I don't want kids. But you are my friend after all and friends help each other out. So fine. I'll help you out. Thanks, Lil Bet. I know that I can count on you. Well, alright, you two. I guess I have no other choice, but I'm gonna teach you how to be good people. Oh, and if, if any of you think about hurting my precious Octa, then I will personally destroy you. Ha, I like to see. You. Uh, 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 uh. Uh, uh. Are you okay? Just accept you two. You guys aren't the strongest people on the earth. Hmm. Yeah! You two are weak. Uh, how is she this powerful? Oh, you see, I've been training with the avatars. And from it, I was able to unlock this new form. Yeah. Hey man, it looks just like your base form. Yeah, both all the potential Super 1 and 2. Wait a minute, but that energy I'm sensing, it's even as strong as my hyper form. Maybe if I can somehow convince the avatars to train me, then in no time I could be back at my full strength. And that will be all I need to defeat the Dark Alliance and save, take back our world. Say, Master Carne. You see, look, man, I got. Uh, 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 uh. Neo. He doesn't mean any harm. Uh, 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 uh. Well, what I was going to say before I was really interrupted there is I want you to train me. Our world is in danger and I no longer have the power to protect it. And for three months I've been trying to reclaim my power but I have made some progress but I'm still not as strong as I used to be. So I want you to help train me. Maybe I can get to how she is. You can unlock my hidden power. You can help me have all bets potential. So please, train me. I'd wish, Lil Bet. The only reason we actually are training Lil Bet is because she helped me. She was able to see the flaws in my ways. And so I'm sorry, Lil Bet. But I assure you that someday your power might return to you. Just have patience, Lil Bet. Your power will return to you someday. Someday, I'm telling you. Ah, Engine, Embryo. I see that you guys have made it. For a second there, I was beginning to think you guys weren't gonna make it. Of course we'll make it. I invented making it. Now, show us these gears that you guys been working on. All right, so this here is a high-speed hover chair, which I invented. Whoever sits on it gets a has a variety of weapons to choose from. All that I invented over here is a high-speed hovercraft equipped with all kinds of hover technology which I invented and all sorts of weapons which I invented. Here we have an energy capsule which I invented and whoever wears the energy capsule will be given a influx of energy that can give them the power to overcome people as strong as supersonic. And over here we have mechanical arms that you could be able to control with your mind, which I invented. And over here we have wings that are made with nanobots, which I invented. And the wings can help you maneuver through any environment. 
And might I also mention that all these gears are equipped with Vengestone alloys that can help you take on people as powerful as elemental masters. So what do you think? So are you saying that this energy capsule can give me the powers of Supersonic? Um, yes. <laughs> well, don't mind if I do. I'll be taking this. You know, I call the hover chair. No, I call the hover chair. It just seems like something that should be belong to me. <laughs> Fine, idiot. I'll just take the hovercraft then. I'll go on ahead and take the wings. And besides, they seem like something that I should have. Alright, so that leaves just the arms for him. Hmm, unique. Actually, we're also working on another project. Well, hasn't completed the project yet, but soon he will. Yes, and what Engine is talking about is that Tibble is making a mech in your liking, which I invented. Hmm, tell me more about this little side project you're working on. Oh, this mech could be able to topple skyscrapers, and it even towers all the sentinels, and it could crush mountains, and be able to level entire cities. It has just the power we need to overturn the war. In our favor. Hmm, I might like your words, funny man. What you're saying is true. Then I could be able to use it to kill all the Ninjago once and for all. The avatars of Earth 4, 5, and 10. It's glad that you can come to visit, but what is the reason of this visit? We have discussed something important that's going on within one of our Earths. Great, I see that there's more of these gods that just sit around and do absolutely nothing. Oh come on, only one of them is like that. So what is it that must be discussed? Well you see, two of my planets of Earth 5 have been destroyed. And the being that destroyed them came from this Earth. And we figured that if we ha you had some guests from Earth 1, we do some questioning with them. Look guys, I don't mean to like alarm you or anything, but definitely might not be Toyo and Tsuke. Because they aren't strong enough to even destroy a planet. And besides, if they even try to, then it'd basically be suicide. And I have lost most of my abilities. So I cannot, like, destroy a planet or something. Well then, if that's the case... Look guys, why don't you just ask Tip Gollum? Him and his Dark Alliance are the people who sh you should be worried about. They've took it over my Earth. And... And... And I have lost my powers. And I'm not strong enough to take them on. So, I want you guys to help me. Help me regain my former power. Look man, we aren't offering any pos apprentice positions. But I would. Look Tori, we shouldn't be getting sidetracked. We need to focus on the mission at hand. And that mission is to find the person that destroyed two of my planets. Well, does the robot know? I don't know. Mecha Han hasn't been himself lately. I'm still trying to figure out what the problem with him is. Oh, I got this. I could probably fix him up. I doubt he can. I was the one who created him in the first place. He's really complex, so I doubt you. Done. Turns out all I have to do is just turn the on switch on him. Finally, you're awake. What's going on? Whoa. going on? Alright ma'am, I think I've discovered who has destroyed two of your planets, ma'am. Oh yeah, I forgot to introduce myself. The name's Mecca. Well then, nice to meet you, Mecca. But I think if we fa figured out who would destroy two of your planets. And who must that be? His name is Galactonite. A long time ago, he was one of the four heroes of Yar that had defeated Void Termina. He defeated who? Yes, and was ultimately sealed away for his power. Fear now it would be dangerous. Man, I would summon him via the Galactic Nova, as he wished to become the strongest fighter in the universe. 
so Mad Knight summoned him, and Mad Knight was able to defeat Galactonite. But I don't think Galactonite took that loss a bit too well. So I assume that somehow he was freed from his seal, okay? And then... What the? What's going on? Um... Crap. I think he found us. Yeah, no crap, Sherlock. Wait, there's Sherlock on Earth 5? No, never mind. Yeah, you're right, never mind. We have bigger things to worry about. I got, I got, oh my god. Ah, ah. <laughs> you guys are weak. I could take care of him. <laughs> All right, bring it on. Yeah, to yeah. Uh. Do you think she needs help or, you know, enough form alone? I think she, she can handle him quite well. She might not even need any help. Yeah. Yeah. What the? Yeah. Uh, uh. Oh. Yeah, I don't think she got it. You know what? Avatars, I'd hate to say it, but I'm lifting the restrictions of you not interfering in mortal affairs. Finally, it's about time. Hey, Galactonite, over here. I bet you can't catch me. Damn it. Chris, are you okay? Don't worry, I got him. Well, you're actually right. They are actually handling him quite well. Yeah, but not for long. We need to seal him away. That's the only way he could be stopped. Yeah, and you know how? Yes. Eh? Uh, uh. There. Now he shouldn't be a problem to us anymore. And why did you do that the whole entire time? We were literally fighting him with, with our lives, and he seriously just stood there and did absolutely nothing. We well, could have just said that the whole time. I just want to know when the right time was right. <sighs> Whatever. Alright, my avatars is done. Mecha, Galactonite won't cause any troubles on your Earth for the time being. Phew, that's a relief. Alright guys, let's head back to our Earths. Anyways, come on, lazy. Let's head back to our Earth. Shankai, you coming? Yes, I'm just... thinking. Well, you can do that once we get back to Earth 10. Alright. Ugh, is it over? Yes, it is. He won't be bothering us anytime soon. Well, now then, guys, I suppose we can head back to the Samurai X cave. Wait a minute. Me too. Like, you're supposing I'm coming along with you, right? Yes, like, you have the power to, like, take on the Dark Alliance. So yeah, it'd basically not be no problem to you. Um, I, I am sorry, little bit. I wish to stay here and continue my training. Come on, you want to stop the Dark Alliance, right? Um, yes. Yes, I do. See? You see, I want to stop the Dark Alliance. You want to stop the Dark Alliance. These two, I think, want to stop the Dark Alliance. I got, we should start a band. We should call it... Um, the, um, the Dark Alliance sucks. No terrible name, um, um, the people that hate the Dark Alliance boys. 
No, 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 that, thing, that, that band name sounds dumb. Um, I like the first band name better. Oh, you do? Yeah. Well, it's great. Come on, guys. Let's head back to the Samurai X cave. Also, don't mind the mess. Stay safe, you guys. Stay safe. Hello there, Dark Alliance. We have returned with the League of Templal. Is something wrong? While you were gone, the Resistance has captured Cortex. Yes, yes, I know. But what's the big deal about it? Well, you see, we've been thinking. And we have discovered that there might be a spy within the Alliance. And how did you come to that conclusion? It might just some, be some dumb coincidence that the Resistance were after Cortex. Cortex was making the gears. And we haven't released any information to the public of these gears. There's no way that any outside sources could have gotten info on the gears. And only us know about the gears. So that might mean that there might be a spy within the Alliance. Look, like that's how you came down to the conclusion? Look, my associates are training right now with their new gears. I believe we should focus on destroying the resistance first. No. Wait, no? Uka Uka, did you just talk back to me? Without the experiments on our side, we're vulnerable. Brain Trap is gone. Cortex is gone. Which one of us is next? Is it you, Eggman? Or you, Bowser? Um, no, I don't think so. No, come to think about it. I actually forgot what I was thinking about. Well, Cortex, instead of destroying the Resistance right now, we should focus more on what's going on within the Alliance. Hold up, I'm the leader of this operation. Not anymore. You have been demoted. But I helped take over the world. You took over the world. We took over the world. You're just a pawn in our little game. You two. I need you two to gather up all the members of the Dark Alliance. I need them here for a little. Thing. We'll do, Lord Uka Uka. A2 better not be fooling around. Uka Uka sees all and knows all. Fine, fine, you're such a pain in the butt. Come on, babe. Let's do his orders. Will do, honey. I, uh, are those two, like, romantically involved? Like, I'm not offended or anything, but... Yes, we are. Why, I have a problem with it? I don't have a problem with it. It just seems odd that... Within a year that you two would be romantically involved. Continue to do how you guys were doing. Alright. Well, that was something. Yeah. Avatars haven't gotten into direct conflict after since the war. For Mazes, that we're all now home. But it's a bummer that I. that Master Carney won't help me regain my lost abilities. Wait a minute. I think I found another way to regain my abilities. And what? Hey, you two. How about you can, like, give me some of your blood? So that way, I can be, like, stronger than I ever was. And I can defeat the entire Dark Alliance with ease. You know what? I'm not sure a little bit. Because, you see, these powers might seem like a gift. But it's actually a curse. Yeah, I know, my powers are a curse, too. But look. If you help me with this, then th that I'll repay you in the long run. Yeah, but a little bit, just what Master Carney said. Your powers will reemerge someday or another. You know what? Maybe you're right. Anyways, guys, let's head to bed. We've got some work to do tomorrow. Alright, Dark Alliance. You're wondering why you're all called here. Yes, a tip gob called you all here. To discuss something urgent with all of you. Because, as it appears, there seems to be a spy within the Dark Alliance. Yeah, we've discovered that one of us has been sending crucial information to the Resistance. And we want to know which one of you is the spy. Or is the traitor within the Dark Alliance. And why exactly am I here instead of King K. Rool? Or King Wart, they're part of the Dark Alliance and we don't know if they're traitors because they're not smart enough. But... Actually, why did we call them up in the first place? Because any one of them could be a traitor. So come on, just confess that you're the traitor and we'll make your sentence a bit less harsh. So, 
any one of you resistant cowards want to step forward and, and stake your treason? Well, fine then. Fine. Looks like we'll have to go the hard way. If any of you refuses to confess that you're a traitor, then I will set this innocent Yoshi on fire and he'll burn alive. I doubt you'd do that, Uka Uka. Oh, I will do it and I won't hesitate. So, who wants to confess? Any of you? Come on. Who wants to step up? So, you're just gonna stay silent, huh? Well, fine then. Have it your way. It was Embryo. He's the spy. Huh. Looks like we have a winner. What? No, 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 no. I'm not the traitor. Like, I know that I, that I hated Cortex back in the day. Like, him stealing credit for what I did. But why would you think I would betray the Dark Alliance? Tell that to the judge. Come on, traitor. We're gonna put you in the dungeon. No, no, don't swear I'm innocent. I'm being framed. I'm being framed! Well, this was a big waste of my time. Yes, we have important matters to deal with. And I can't believe Embryo was the spy. Oh, now I guess I'm all alone. Cortex captured by the Resistance. I got no one. Oh, well. Time to go back to inventing stuff. And yeah, you do that, Engine. You do that. You do that.